Hello, God bless you, Rigo. This is Pastor Mark Miracle from Prestige Gospel Center, Port Harcourt, Nigeria, West Africa. This is an urgent prophecy for Nigeria and Nigerians abroad. I repeat again, this is an urgent prophecy for Nigeria and Nigerians abroad. This is October 2023. The remaining phase of October, the, the remaining two weeks in October and the first week of November, God opened my eyes to the realms of the spirit and I saw a situation where it looks as if many, many who never expected to leave Mother Earth, it dawned on them that life was cut short. So God says I should put out this prophecy urgently. As a matter of fact, because of this, we've had a service program for next Sunday against the power of death. Death through accident, death through mistake, going to places you never thought of, you never expected, invitations that you never planned for, stray bullets, kidnap, assassin. God says that the strange, there is a strange, ugly demons that are rearing up their heads, blood sucking demon this season. This is the first prophecy for Nigerians at home and Nigerians abroad. The second one, I see about four persons. Four persons that has kidney diseases, kidney diseases. There is a prayer God has prepared to you, prepared for you. Pardon me, via the prophet. Now, wherever you are, you have a kidney disease and you are standing somewhere and you have a bottle of water close to you now. Now, hold that water and I pray over it in the name of Jesus. As you partake of this water, God who called me and sent me to do his bidding, I come according to the volume of books he has written and sent concerning me. I command the blood of Jesus saturate that water. As you drink that water in the name of Jesus, four of you, I command kidney disease now to be swallowed up in the name of Jesus. There is another set of three women. This prophecy we come across to. Two are outside Nigeria. One is in Nigeria. And somebody will say, why only three women? When millions of people may be watching this video. But for now, the three women whose faith are connected. Three of you, two, you are looking for a child. One is looking for a boy. You have guests, 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 guests all over the place. You are looking for a boy for your, for your husband. One, the two are looking for a child they have never had. God says I should tell you, count October, count from the last week of October. As a matter of fact, you are near your um, uh, uh, ovulation. How do you call it? Ovulation. Now you are near it. God says you count between now, between now, from October to nine months. The prophet has spoken. You will carry your baby in the name of Jesus. The next set of persons, Nigerians in Nigeria and those outside Nigeria that this prophet is reaching out to. That is one. You are looking out for a way to settle down. You are looking out for a way to settle down. One of you, the woman is from the west. The second person, the lady is from the north. The third person, the lady is from the west as well. But you are from the north. Now hear me. God says I should tell you, pray three midnight prayers where the face of this woman, whether you have the picture on your phone or not, that he's going to give you a dream as pertaining the, 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 the ceiling, the union you're about to seal. There is nothing that God has given me to say out there that I don't apply wisdom. Are you understanding me now? I always apply wisdom. There are things I will say openly online here and there are some things I will tell you. Call me. Contact the number in this uh, YouTube channel and from the TikTok where you're watching this video and the prophecy will be sealed up and concluded. There are things I will not say online. I say it pertains this particular issue of the man who wants to settle down with a lady. This man, how you know yourself? You have a tribe mark on your face and you are in your 40s. The second man, you don't have a tribal mark, you are from the east. You deal in toiletries. When I mean toiletries, uh, ceramics, uh, toilet, uh, bathroom stuff, so you know yourself. And the fourth, pe the third person, you, I said you are from the, you, you, you are looking at someone from the north. You have lots of things you sell that has to do with agriculture. Now, quickly, I'm moving to the next prophecy that has to do with the political settings in Nigeria. Now, in this October, I prophesied in the the first week of October that many people in the House of Assembly, in the legislature, in the uh, what, how do you call it, assembly, uh, how do you call it again, Senate, in fact, National Assembly generally, generally the lawmaking bodies, that they need prayer, that many of them have health issues. And we, we are not done with that prophecy. Somebody from Sokoto who is a lawmaker died. Now is a message God says I should pass to four governors in Nigeria. 
four governors in Nigeria, and I'm not going to call their name. One is from the north, two are from the western part, and the other you know yourself. This is the reason you are battling with the secret. Uh, uh, what do I call it? A personal disease. You don't want anyone to know about it. You don't want anyone to know about it. How does this video get to them? I may not know whether you classify me in the minor prophet or in the major prophet. But I know that someone close to someone that is close to these governors will see this video. And I am stretching forth my hand. I command in the name of Jesus. Three of you, I command instant healing. Then one person, that is something you have to confess. That is something you have to go to the altar. Kneel down. Yes, a I'm the number one citizen. How do I do this? I don't know. God says, go to the altar, kneel down, and tell God you have mercy for this thing you did. You know that it's between you and God. Have mercy for this thing I did. So that sickness will not lead to your death. Now I see, I see health threatening situations around four governors in Nigeria. Now another prophecy is coming heavily as it pertains the pregnant women, those who want to give birth. I command in the name of Jesus, there will not be still birth. You will not die during delivery. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. Now, this is final one. In this closing part of October, I see the harvest ripening. I see seed opening. I see applications being received. I see many people who have been looking for jobs. I see that, that the atmosphere clear. I see your seed is being given. The urgent attention is needed. Both those of you watching from in, in Nigeria and those watching from abroad, I pray now in the name of Jesus and by the power of the Holy Ghost, everywhere you submitted your seed, in the name of Jesus, I command open doors now. I command invitation now. I command that that job be given to you now. In the name of Jesus, we pray. Amen. I am Pastor McMiracle from Prestige Gospel Center. As a matter of fact, I am praying from the altar now, altar of our church. There is no prayer prayed here that God has not mercifully answered. It's an altar of mercy, altar of solution. Now, you want to reach me for an expansion of a prophecy that has to do with you. You just watched this video. Now, you have liver issue. They told you you have cancer. You have some cancerous cells in your body. God has a, he has programmed your healing. You want to reach me out for personal prayers, direct prayers from TikTok or from YouTube or from Facebook, wherever you are watching this video from. My number is, if you are in Nigeria, 081-232-88593. 081-232-88593. You are reaching from outside the country. You just add plus 234. Remove the first zero. Add plus 234. Plus 234 81-232-88593. Plus 234 81 Now there are Prayers I will have to take as concise some situation. It might be three midnight prayers. It might be two midnight prayers. It might be one day prayers. But I want to tell you, this is an altar of solution. God has sent me for the solution that to the problems that besiege mankind. He told me for every problematic situation, there is a prophetic solution. This is Pastor Mac Miracle. God bless you, Rico. Have a nice time. Those of you watching from USA, Canada, Australia, Nigeria, Angola, wherever you are watching from, there is a solution for that problem. God bless you, Regood. Have a nice day.